went to Madagri to meet Joyce Henry Andrew, aka Mama Supreme. And we told her that she will be our metro. And that we also want her to join us to empower widows. Which she agreed and she told us that she will connect us to foreign donors. And she told us that she has grants that we should register for her grants. And she will give us each cluster 150 million that she told Nigerians 350 million but because we came late that she will give us 150 million brethren because I wanted something good for the Nigerian widows and I saw it as a great opportunity if somebody can get 150 million it will help her to empower others and to empower herself. I told my people, I registered, I paid. I told my people, many registered, to gather the money and send to Joyce. She also told us about projects. If you bring 100,000, she will give you a project of 1 million. I registered my own, and I, I registered my own with 1 million. And I told my widows, because I saw it as opportunity for us to be blessed. I told my widows, some registered with 1 million, some registered with 500, some registered with 1.715 million, some registered with 2 million, some registered with 100,000, some registered with 500, some registered with 600, some registered with 15,000, just like that. She also told us about rice that she will she is connected to uk they are giving her food stores that we should just pay logistics for transport and many widows all over nigeria they contributed millions and sent for her and the food was not delivered she also told us about car that she wants to help widows swallow that she doesn't want to collect money that we should all only bring money that will help her to bring out the cars from where she brought them <clears throat> from where she kept them and that con connecting demorage from her some now gave her according to the car you wanted some gave her two fifty thousand some gave her five hundred thousand some gave her hundred thousand some gave her different amounts I myself, I gave her 250,000. She told me that she would give us those cars during the carnival we had in the garden. And we didn't see the car. She also brought the issue of... Good morning, everybody. Good morning. All Nigerians from presidents from presidency down to the grassroots. This is Evangelist Dr. Ambassador Victoria Enojobo. I want this voice not to go anywhere in all the nooks and crannies of the world. And I want everybody to record today, Friday, 16th day of August, 2024. I call Jehovah Elohim to bear me witness today as I stand on his altar to declare this verse note. I call God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Ghost. I call the angels of God. I call the land. I call the sea. I call heaven and earth. I call the moon. I call the stars. I call the sky. I call all the nature all the animals, all the human beings. I call all the trees, all the birds, all the insects. I call living and non-living things to bear me witness today as I give her this voice note. I give all the glory to Jehovah Almighty who has given us the, the, the power <coughs> to move ahead 
is the one that has given us breath, life, and every good thing. May his name be exalted. Daddy, I give you all the glory in the name of Jesus Christ. This is Evangelist Dr. Ambassador Victoria Enojobo giving this voice note. I want to give this voice note and I call all the security agencies in the National Widows Forum to kindly kind record this voice note for future purposes. National Widows Forum is a forum that has national, regional, state, local government, and the world coordinators. It's a forum that has legal departments, medical departments, <clears throat> military, paramilitary, different agencies. Are members of Widows Forum. We have timbers and calibers. We have people that matter in Widows Forum. And uh, I am not taking it for granted that it pleases Jehovah Almighty God to pass through me to bring his baby called the Residence Divine Widows Foundation, aka the National Widows Forum. I give him all the glory and I will not take his position and his calling for granted. Yes, the National Widows Forum came into existence. The vision came in between February and the March 2022. The vision of the National Widows Forum is to gather widows together for God to rule over them and to protect them and take care of them. We selected people and we went to Badagri to meet Joyce Henry Andrew, aka Mama Supreme. And we told her that she will be our metro. And that we also want her to join us to empower widows, which she agreed and she told us that she will connect us to foreign donors. And she told us that she has grants that we should register for her grants and she will give us each cluster 150 million that she told Nigerians 350 million but because we came late that she will give us 150 million. Brethren, because I wanted something good for the Nigerian widows and I saw it as a great opportunity if somebody can get 150 million it will help her to empower others and to empower herself. I told my people, I registered, I paid. I told my people, many registered to gather the money and send to Joyce. She also told us about projects. If you bring 100,000, she will give you a project of 1 million. I registered my own, and I, I registered my own with 1 million. And I told my widows, because I saw it as opportunity for us to be blessed. I told my widows some registered with 1 million, some registered with 500, some registered with 1.715 million, some registered with 2 million, some registered with 100,000, some registered with 500, some registered with 600, some registered with 15,000, just like that. She also told us about Rice, that she, will, she is connected to UK, they are giving her food stores that we should just pay logistics for transport. And many widows all over Nigeria, they contributed millions and sent to her. And the food was not delivered. She also told us about car, that she wants to help widows swallow. 
that she doesn't want to collect money, that we should all, only bring money that will help her to bring out the cars from where she brought them. From where she kept them. That con connecting demon rage from her. Some now gave her, according to the car you wanted, some gave her 250,000, some gave her 500,000, some gave her 100,000, some gave her different amounts. I myself, I gave her 250,000. She told me that she would give us those cars during the carnival we had. We didn't see the car. She also brought the issue of a rapper. She collected six sisters and from widows amounting to millions. She didn't give them rappers. She brought up many things. She met us, told us that she, she has connected with uh, European, UK, London, that they will be paying Nigeria widows. The widows should bring 33,000 to open accounts. Widows pay 33,000, mounting to millions, and no single account was opened till today. Later, she told us that she has gotten a people that are giving out loan, and they will give out loan. If you pay 100,000, you collect loan of upfront, you collect loan of 1 million. If you pay 500,000, just like that, 500,000, just like that, many widows pay, they have some bed, 1 million, some bed, 2 million, some bed, 500, some bed, 100,000, some bed, 10,000, some bed, 20,000, some bed, 30,000. And from today till today, loan was not given to anybody. She brought up Ambassador that they should pay 20,000 and 27,000 for accommodation. That is 47,000. Many widows paid millions to her. And she did what she knew. She, she called Ambassador, whatever, whatever. Many, only very few. Very few till today. No, nothing like certificates. And many, many widows registered. She made millions out of it. Hello, everybody listening. Because I have been hearing many things. But I left it for God. I left it for God. So, my people, the national, the, the members of Widows Forum, now bounced on me. They became angry. They said I was the one that introduced them to Joyce, that I must help them. I must help them to bring out the money. I kept on disturbing Joyce. I kept on disturbing her. Joyce will promise today, tomorrow she will say another thing. Later, I had to involve the husband and uh, they were able to give us, uh, uh, first of all, 200,000 letter to out of billions that owe us. 200,000 letter, 200,000 letter, 100,000, just like that, amounting to 700,000. My, the, my money that Joyce is owing me is two million. My personal money, two million two hundred and fifty thousand. I troubled her, troubled that she sent me two hundred thousand for my personal money. Then <clears throat> later we disturb her, disturb her. We went to Badagari. We signed the agreement with her. She said she will pay us everything. Uh, June 2023. But that from that June 2023, we did not see anything. Let us a mounted pressure on them, mounted pressure. The husband was able to raise some money 100, 200,000, 200,000, 100,000, amounting to 700,000. So, we waited for Joyce, the widows, widows were troubling me. Many of them became angry, they were troubling me, and I decided to carry the body. 
They were insulting Joyce. They were saying all sorts of things. They were ready to take her to court. They were ready to summon her to juju. They were ready to do this. And now told widows, I say, because of the way we started with Joyce, that I will like us to end well with Joyce, that I will not like us to take her to Bereketa. Some say Bereketa, some have even consulted different places to arrest her. I pleaded with widows. I said they should just give me time. Let me walk on her to see if she could pay. When I noticed that Joyce refused to pay, she will tell me this month, another month she will tell me another thing, she will just like that. I decided to involve security agencies. And security agencies, they involved, they were involved. And the Joyce promised the time she would pay the money. Then at my back, the same state coordinators, the same widows that were attacking me, that I took them to Joyce, that I took them to Joyce, that I must bring their money. At my back, they will go and be and befriending Joyce. Anything I say in the platform, they will carry it to Joyce. The same widows, the same women, the same women that are attacking me, even as I'm talking now, most of them are at Abuja now. <clears throat> the same women that are attacking me, that I am the one that took them to Joyce, that I must bring their money back to them. The same women are going at my back, moving with Joyce, saying all sorts of things against me, told Joyce not to give me not to pay them their money through me, that they should give them their money direct. As I'm talking now, many of them are in Abuja in the name that Joyce wants to disburse. They, they called meeting among themselves and they open platform among themselves. These are the widows that I took, that have been fighting me, that I took them to Joyce. But at my back, they formed the platform and they, 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 they plan to get there and told Joyce to pay them their money directly. As I'm talking now, many of them are in Abuja in the name that Joyce said she wants to dispose. I am making this first note to clear myself from anything Joyce and the widows for What I told Joyce is that the money I paid directly to her, she must pay it directly. She must pay it to me to give the widows. The same widows that have been fighting me and attacking me, that I'm the one that took them to Joyce, that I must bring their money back. I involved security agencies and the, the Joyce has told those security agencies the time she will pay them their money, to repair us our money. And these same widows went at my back to have meeting with Joyce and told Joyce not to pay their money through me. I am making this voice not to clear myself and clear my hands and to wash off. I have left them to collect their money from Joyce directly. I have left the members of Windows Forum to collect their money directly from Joyce. But those ones that are weak, that, that still believe, that still trust in me, I want Joyce to give me the money I gave to her direct so that I can give to those ones. Because those ones, they don't know Joyce and Doros for number. They don't communicate with her. Even though she calls them, they can't pick their calls. But those ones that said that Joyce should pay directly to them, I am making it open because it is not tomorrow they will come back again to say that I took them to Joyce. As far as I'm concerned, Joyce has paid them and I want them to pay their state widows. If I wait for them, they don't pay their state widows, I will summon them somewhere and I'll bring out all their messages because I have their messages, I have their private chats, I have their platforms, I have everything that's saying. 
as far as I'm concerned now, Joyce Henry Andra has paid them. So let them begin to settle their widows. So I want everybody to know that I have has off. That nobody, no member of National Widows Forum should involve me again in anything pertaining to Joyce. They should go with her. They should go. They have started to deal with her directly. They should collect their money direct, directly and, and reform back their state widows. I want God to be my witness. I want Elohim to be my witness. That is why I am making this voice note. And the, even our security agencies, our security agencies in our platform, our members that are security agencies, I have tabled this before them. They have taken record of that. That any other day, any, any widow will rise up, we talk again that I am the one that took them to Joyce. These security agencies will petition them and bring them to book. I want to tell all the coordinators of National Widows from, from National down to the grassroots that you have told Joyce to pay you directly. You are in platform with Joyce. Some of you are in Abuja as we are talking now. Please make sure you collect the money and pay your widows. Any 10 naira that Joyce took from the widows in your state, make sure you collect that money and pay your widows. I, I, the one that I am telling Joyce to pay me now is the one I paid directly to her that belongs to those ones that are weak that don't know Joyce's voice, uh, phone number. Any money I paid directly to Joyce, Joyce must give it to me directly. If not, I know where to summon the matter to. Why it seems as if I am somehow weak concerning Joyce's matter is because I am remembering how we started. We started in peace and I want us to end in peace. We went to her, she accepted us. We started with Joyce Henry in peace. We started with her in peace. I want to end up with her in peace. I don't want to end up with her in trouble. Especially her husband who has been so good. Her husband has been so good. When people are talking evil about that young man, I normally say that they don't know that man. If you know the husband of Joyce Henry Andrew, that man, forget her hair, forget anything. That man is a humanitarian. That man is a compassionate man. And I will not like to have problem with his family. I will not like to have problem with his family. That is why I am begging Joyce to settle me in peace. Those ones that say she should pay them directly, please pay them directly. But there are people, there are millions of widows for members, millions of members of widows for that don't know Joyce Henry and those phone number. They don't call her. They don't have it. They depend on me to collect their money. Please, Joyce Henry and these are the people you should give me their money. Let me reform them. Please, those ones that are wise, those ones that are uh, uh, Widow's Forum has opened their eyes, Widow's Forum has made them now to come out, people have known them, and they think that they can now work against the person that put them in the post, they think that they will now know more than the person that brought them out. Please, they said you should pay them directly, please pay them directly. But when you pay them directly, please monitor them and make sure that they give that money to the widows in the states. Because that is where I will have problem with them. 
the agencies in the national widows forum are waiting they are watching they are quietly they don't make a noise they don't talk they are quietly watching they are observing everything that is happening in widows forum we have dss we have efcc we have uh, uh, um, uh, we have high profile police personnel we have we have paramilitary we have military we have them we have the idea high profile people that they are, they are listening they know everything i have told them everything they have kept record of everything so those ones that are so wise that say you should pay them directly please pay them directly but there are weaker ones there are ones that still believe and know millions of them that believe and know that Victoria is their leader. That is the Victoria that brought them to you. That they never know you apart from Victoria. They are not wiser like others. They are not way forward, or too forward like others. Please, I beg you, give me their money. Let me give them so that there will be peace. I don't want to have problem with your family. Please, Joyce Henry Andrew, a.k.a. Mama Supreme. I have I have become part of your family, which you know. I know your parents. Their parents have known me. Your, ch your children, your son, your, your husband. I am just like a family member. And I've never wronged you. And I'm begging you. I don't want to wrong you. I don't want to hurt you. I've never hurt you before. In short, my widows are angry that I love you more than I love them. Nothing they didn't do for me to fight you, which you know I refuse to fight you. The same widows went at my back to come to you to speak against Victoria. I welcome it. I accept it. I accept it. But what I'm begging you, because my own know the day good. My trouble know the day good. When I start, you know the day good. I they use anything to fight. I they go any length to fight. When I want to fight, what I'm begging you, please, I still remember that very day I came to you. And your husband welcomed us. You, you welcomed us. I am just like a family member in your family. Your parents, they know me. Please, please, I beg you, just give me the money I gave to you. Let me give to my people that still believe in me, the ones that are weak, they, don't, they cannot fight for themselves. Please, I beg you. So, I want every Nigerian to know that every tankable that we send to Joyce, Joyce will give it to the widows directly. They have told Joyce to give it to them directly. And she will give it to them directly. They should get up and fight for their money and collect it directly. Victoria is only fighting for the ones that gave her, the weaker ones that will not fight for themselves. And today, I want to call God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Ghost, to cause, to place judgment on any tongue that will talk evil against my, my name again. On any tongue that will call me in any nonsense name. Everything I did for widows was for, it, for things to be okay for us. And before I will tell them I must have done, I will do before I will tell them. What we are looking for on our own that some of the widows contributed money, only few. Sometimes when we look at the large number of widows in widows forum, we think that it's all of them that are paying. Like a one animal that was calculating, uh, whether she was calculating 15,000 times a million, this one, a fool like him. Men are helping widows. Men are calling us to give something to widows. But that animal, who, ha who is going pew, pew, pew in Widows Forum platform to, to collect what is meant for widows. Pete was calculating how much uh, 15,000 uh, local government. I told local government to pay so so. I told her uh, uh, that one is an animal. You don't answer animals. 
but I'm giving this voice not that any from today anybody that will call me name that God does not call me may judgment fall on that person may judgment of God fall on that person in the name of Jesus Christ everything I'm doing in widows form is to make the widows to smile any contribution that we tell widows to contribute is to bring something greater and God has answered to bring something greater to empower widows and whatever they paid, whatever they did, whatever they contributed, is not up to 15, 20% of what we are spending. God is my witness. May God forgive all that called me bad men. But anybody that will repeat it will be judged by fire. This is all I have to say. I want agencies to bear me witness. I want our legal department to bear me witness. I want every lawyer in the whole country to bear me witness that today the national widows, some of them that are so wise, some of them that are so forward, some of them that are rebellious, they told Joyce to pay that they will collect their money directly. So Joyce is giving them their money directly. My hands are off there. But I will fight for the weak ones. I will fight. I will fight for the weak ones to collect their money and give to them. Jehovah bear me witness today. I call heaven and earth to bear witness today. And anybody that will call me evil name again will go for it. The judgment of God will fall on that person. Anyone that will hear something without verifying it and you are carrying it up and down to destroy somebody, Jehovah will destroy you. You will not go free. I tell people that nobody does evil to me and goes free. That person receives judgment of God here on earth before talking about heaven. Let everybody be warned. My people and the widows for those that still believe in me, the weak ones that don't have power to go straight to Joyce. Please, just calm down. Joyce will give us our money. I am ready to go to any length to collect that money. She will give us our money. When she gives us our money, you will collect your money. Every 10 kobo you paid, we paid to Joyce. You will collect your money. Thank you and God bless you. I remain unbeatable in the name of Jesus Christ. Shalom. Amen.